trying mozzarella sticks from Trader Joe's but I've heard really great things about it so I'm excited to try this orange chicken of course you have to get the orange chicken when you go to Trader Joe's avocado I bought this watermelon cucumber so we bought two shrimp burgers I'm cooking some right now because we're starving and I got apple blossoms. I've seen a lot of people um, rave about this, so I'm excited to try this as well. And then I got, of course, coconut, mango coconut. This is my first time trying this flavor, so I'm excited to try that one. We actually got three shrimp burgers. The other one, my favorite, peach bellini. What? I tried this. Um, I watched Chevy's, um, I think, Summer Essentials, something like that. And this is a coconut body butter. So, the last but not least, cookie butter ice cream. I'm excited for this. So, I didn't see the ice cream sandwiches that I usually get, but I love ice cream. So, I bought this. Go, Kai. Go, Kai. Go, Kai. My name is Kai Kai, sitting in my high chair. You already know how I got here. My mommy and daddy built it up for me to sit here. I'm watching Blues Clues No Blues. Hey guys, so I just finished my first sponsorship video and I'm feeling blessed, okay? <laughs> okay, so let me give you guys a little backstory. Around the time I was supposed to give birth, which was in March, <laughs> um, a brand reached out to me 
asking me for my rates because they wanted me to promote their product for them and i was like oh my gosh because i've always wanted to do that kind of thing um i never really knew how to go about it but this brand found me and they inquired so i was like yes of course i'll do this for you guys whatever so they sent me the product um and you know they never gave me like a deadline or anything they would they just wanted the video and that was that so literally after i gave birth i had messaged them no i tried to make the video first but i just didn't like how i was looking because obviously i just gave birth my belly was um discolored and it's like all discolored and i'm fat and i'm ugly and stuff like that so i didn't really like the video and i had wrote them letting them know like um, you know, I just gave birth. I just have a newborn. So please bear with me as I try to make this video. Long story short, I ended up never doing the video because I just kind of, you know, I was, I'm a new mom. So I honestly forgot about it. Um, every now and then it would cross my mind like, oh shit, I still have this video to do. Anyways they reached out to me about a week ago and they basically still wanted to work with me you guys and so they basically said like you know we know you're a new mom and we just wanted you to get settled in but we're still up for the offer if you're ready to make the video just let us know or if you still want to work with us just let us know and you know she wished me all the best with my family and hope that um you know my baby my family was okay and i just my heart was just so warm and i was like yes i'll definitely do this for you guys so yeah i just finished filming that um if you're not following me on instagram follow me on instagram so you can see the video you can go get yourself a product and this is the kind of energy i want in my life okay so you guys check that out go like the reel the video that i posted and let me know what you guys think of my video this is my first promotion video ever so let me know what you guys think of it yeah it's friday i'm not doing anything today um i'm just gonna be in the house and yeah i'm gonna sip my wine relax with my child and yeah i'll catch you guys tomorrow because i'm going out tomorrow with my best friend and it's gonna be a girls night out we're gonna get drink and all that good stuff so i'll see you guys tomorrow I know this lighting is so trash oh my gosh but i'm at my best friend's house it's friday night and we about to get lit all right i'm gonna bring y'all with me
it's me um i can't even remember where i left the vlog off but i'm here um this is a pretty boring vlog i'm not gonna lie like i haven't really been doing much this week this weekend look i'm just training right now guys i'm still mad fat like i need to lose some weight but anyways here yeah, i'm home um i just got in not too long ago i just wanted to show you guys a little pickup that i made i met my man at king's plaza today we had to get some candles and stuff like that and he got me a little gift he told me to pick out what i wanted so i did <laughs> but um yes yeah, so we went to perfume perfume mania he was getting cologne for himself i decided to go with Ooh La Rouge, Ooh La Rouge by Christian Siriano. So let me know in the comments if you guys have this perfume, if you guys like it. Let me know what you think of it. When I smelled it, I fell in love, okay? Um, I really wanted to get her by Burberry, but this one smells so much better and they didn't even have her anymore. Um, and I also wanted to get miss dior absolutely blooming because when i had originally i had miss Dior already but just the regular one i can't remember the name but anyways i went to sephora to get the absolutely blooming this was around christmas time and she accidentally wrapped the wrong freaking perfume and i'm so mad when i got home i realized that she gave me the wrong one and i didn't even want to go back and return or whatever i'm just i'm just gonna keep it but they didn't even have absolutely blooming at the store anymore so i'm just like whatever let me get this because it's a baccarat dupe if you guys never smelled this go smell it it's really so good and it smells like baccarat so yeah this is the packaging i just wanted to open it with you guys i really don't like the color red like at all so it's all right i just wish it was pink or something red gives me old lady vibes for real so it also comes with a little gift this is red lipstick i guess i never wear red lipstick i think i look like a clown with red lipstick on so i doubt that i'll use that so yeah this is how the perfume looks like I said, I hate the color red. It's just giving me old lady vibes, but it smells so good. So I'm just like, I don't really care about the color. Is this supposed to be moving? But yeah, it's like a little flower. This is really cute. So, and it has Ola Rouge on the side. I like this. This is not bad. Um, so yeah. I'm going to just read um, the details about this perfume if you guys thinking about picking it up. But, um, yeah, so me personally, I like really fruity, floral scents. I don't think floral, but more sweet, fruity scents. But not too much, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to smell like a little girl, but at the same time... I like sweet scents like that's just what it is um i hate musky scents i hate masculine scents like mark jacobs daisy was one of the first perfumes that i bought and i loved it like that's just the kind of scents that i like so it says um top notes is ruby grapefruit enchanted praline saffron flower saffron flower <laughs> Heart notes is white star jasmine, mysterious gardenia, pearly tuberose, and the base notes is pink sugar moss, heavenly musk, blonde amberwood. So yeah, um, it was eighty five dollars, I think. Yeah, and I'm looking online and it has like five stars all over, so I'm guessing it's pretty good. There's a lot of great reviews. Everybody's saying it's a dupe. It's very similar to Baccarat four fifty. So yeah you guys if you want to smell sexy and if you want to smell expensive but you don't want to spend 300 dollars on baccarat get this okay <laughs> so um yeah right now it's 7 58 i'm about to cook i'm about to make some shrimp fried rice and some trader joe's orange chicken i'll catch you guys later or if i don't i'm gonna end the vlog here thank you guys for watching I'll be back with another video. I love you guys.